mostly with that. I've been putting together right now I do bits and pieces of it in other for the for the paper, for example, for the original. I couldn't understand what happened to us. They were writing on the symposium and wanted to know what it was that become really immortal. No, and the friend of the god. That was the problem. Great. So I sent a proposal and they agreed to it. But then as I was trying to I mentioned his parent who says, we have to tell them that we're writing it about me, right? And I think in there, I don't remember, I haven't written the excerpt with, an, with, a, with the goal of hiding it, concealing it, you know? Uh, this is going to be a dream from November 14th, Tuesday. Oh, that's you. Oh. <laughs> Come on up. make of it. What? Have you thought about it? Have you wondered about it? Well, I looked up Epinomus. Good. And it talked about, I don't know if it talked about a philosopher, what's a philosopher, and other stuff. What's wisdom? I don't, so I don't know exactly, but... But wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Did you enjoy it? It was intriguing, yeah. Huh? Yeah. What do you think of that? Wait, what do you think of that? Well, it's something that I'm working on for myself to realize. To realize? And act and live and try to, yeah. But yeah. It sure is emotional. Oh, Jeffrey. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, so, mm -hmm. um, <clears throat> have you ever, ever thought of looking at that book before? Uh, well, I'm struck by the, the word, too. Epinomis is very no, intriguing. Have, oh, yeah. Have, have you read, no. never read it before? I think I have looked at it before, but... but it didn't have any personal... No, no impact. Yeah, good. good, good. <laughs> well, but it's now having an impact. Yeah. What do you, what do you make of that? Well, I... Um, well, in the same way that that dean, the woman who was the dean who was reading the book, she, she and I hit it off. She was, she was interesting to talk to. Oh. And she's the only dean I've ever seen get fired <laughs> because she was too forthright. Yeah, 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 yeah. By the way, when I asked you what do you think of it, Yeah. Um, do you think it was worthwhile getting into the dialogue, Epi Anonymous? A couple, well, yeah, for you. Did you, find, the, did you find it useful, interesting? Well, after the dream I yeah. opened it up. Or yeah, yeah. I looked it up. I and looked it up. I Googled it. Yes, good. Yeah, okay. and, yeah, come on. <laughs> and, and what did it, what does it do to you? Uh, well, immediately I thought, great. But then it seemed like it was too sketchy. Mm -hmm. And it wasn't really an in-depth look at either one, the philosopher or wisdom. So I kind of rejected it mm. and said, oh, it's not important. Uh, but you did see something about rejecting it, didn't you? What was the reason? Come on, what did you come up with that brought you to reject it? Well, I'd have to read it myself and study it. No, just your, come on. Mm. You have some, you know, certainly well, have an idea. 
I thought I'd have to do some work. Oh, I thought I would have to do some work. Yeah. Uh -huh. To really make it my own. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At what point did you realize that? Well, when I saw that the concepts of wisdom and the philosopher, it, it wasn't clearly spelled out. What Good, good. You saw there, there was a weakness in the dialogue. Yeah, right? yeah. Talking about wisdom and the philosopher, there was some lack of connection that you were hoping to get, but didn't, or, or at least up to that point. Right. Did you finish the dialogue? No, no, no. Oh. I didn't even start uh -oh. it. I just, in fact, I was scared to, yeah, scared yeah. to look, because I yeah. was... Oh, you are going to finish it? Yeah, I'm going to read it. Oh, the whole thing. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> You're asking me to predict whether I'll read the whole thing? That's right. I I don't predict. <laughs> Come on, I don't. I don't, I don't, I'm, I don't want to commit to anything. <laughs> so why not? What what violation is that? A violation? You should thou should not commit oneself to that kind of thing. Well, because I'm afraid I won't do it, and then I'll be looking. Oh, so feeling, a good way to avoid. Looking and feeling is to feel that you're not going to do it anyhow, so you might as well not, not go any further. Do it, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah, yeah, that's a strategy I use. Yeah, that's a strategy you use. Yeah. Yeah, could you put it again? I avoid doing stuff. That not especially certain kinds of stuff. Yeah. But good stuff. Yeah. Right, right. So if there's some good stuff. Right. Right? Mm-hmm. You're going to go along until you suddenly... Go ahead. Stop because you realize you're going to have to commit yourself? Is that the way you put it? Well, yeah. I mean, if I give you an answer, if I tell you I'm going to finish it, then... I feel like I'm committed. Uh, what's wrong with that? Okay, come on, you did it before. Well, then you can, or I can, not finish, and then... Then, not finish. And then there's grounds for my having a problem, or being asked what came up, and... So, so... If you commit yourself, you know you're not going to finish it. I have to be accountable if I commit I'll have myself. to be accountable, okay? Yeah. I'll have to be accountable. Like I knew a person who was accountable, and <laughs> yeah. they, it was terrible. They have went through hell. Yeah, I know strange people. Well, it's weird. It's really well, weird. What's weird about it? it Maybe sounds, it fits what I know. It sounds awful that I'm really... It's awful. Yeah, because I'm the big proponent of people being accountable, you know. Yeah, I and you're not. I pay service to that, and I'm the biggest one who's <laughs> Yeah, you're not. the biggest one, yeah. yeah. Especially about things that are good, right? Yeah. Yeah. And so there you're going along and you see there may be a connection between wisdom and the philosopher. And you realize at that point you are going to have to commit yourself. Yeah. And split. <laughs> right? Yeah. Or dismiss it. Yeah. Yeah. As Say, watch, I'm still on the same question. Yeah. What do you make of this? This dream? This ep no, no, oh. exactly what we're talking about, okay. this episode. Mm. Oh. 
See, that's vague enough to let you move in the direction that you might want until I wait to see whether it's going to go where I would like you to go. See, so I'm very cautious. I'm called Pierre the Cautious One. Go ahead. Hmm. <laughs> well, um, I mean, I guess it seems like... Oh. You nearly got it. You killed it. <laughs> It's putting... Well, that must have been good to kill it. Well, it's but, just what? putting the stuff into words is... You're stuck on the words. These words. What words? Come on. Talking about the value of mm -hmm. wisdom and... Yeah. Yeah, and talking just, about the value, of importance, value of wisdom. And studying and philosophy and knowing... Yeah. Showing what I know. Yeah. Just, um, yeah, that's dangerous. Right? Agree? I don't know what. Something about the words. Um. Yeah, yeah. Shall I go back to my question? Yeah. You find it interesting that you had a dream. Mm -hmm. that, hey, that revealed a knowledge of Plato's dialogues, could write, that, could tell you which one, and you had to be careful even about your spelling, because as you said, you weren't sure of it, you had to check it. Right? No. Interesting. What? Well, I, I didn't check the spelling. Well, okay. But... Linguistically, I thought the combination of epi and gnomus was interesting linguistically. Yeah, in what way? Well, because I'm fascinated with the epi part. Yeah, go ahead. In Parmenides, yeah. we've got the epi something. And in psychology, there's epi things. Yeah. So I'm always curious about the epi. Yeah. And so then the gnomos. And, and, you've, and you found it very attractive, enjoyed it then. Epinomus. The oh, name, the yeah. title. Yeah, yeah. And by the way, notice, mm -hmm. in your dream came the name of one dialogue, right. and we were able to identify your basic problem. Hey, what do you think mm -hmm. of that? Your dream yeah. is including in it uh -huh. One idea of Plato's, one idea, yeah. one, one important idea, and it yeah. woke up all of this, which is your problem. Yeah. What, right. do, you make, what, what do you think of that? Well, I like the timing, because we're yeah, talking yeah, I'll about... Yeah, forget the timing. <laughs> okay. what? Come on. <laughs> yes, the timing is essential, by the way. Yeah. Yeah, so put that in at the same okay. time and answer, what do you think of what's going on? Well... Well, mm. would you agree you're getting a dream that's rather important for you already? We haven't even yeah. gone through the material. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. We come right to the heart of it, didn't we? Right. Yeah. Well, you must be favored by the dream master. Mm. What do you think of that? Well, um, <laughs> I don't think so. Well, look what it's doing. Well, yeah. <laughs> it's good. Now, see, mm. I'm going to add to this in order to make sure that you are going to have to quit. Okay. Why? What do you see? Well, because the more important this becomes, certainly yeah. the desire... You're going to have to commit. You're going to be committing. And that's going to raise right. this problem, isn't it? Right. Yeah. So you must be a favorite among the dream masters <laughs> to drop you in one, one expression from a dialogue you were not familiar with. You find that curious or interesting? I do. I do. 
Yeah, the dream master must know your problem, huh? And how to reach it? <laughs> Shoot, yeah. I, I, yeah. Yeah. Say, so, uh, would you do just like, one more thing? Yeah. Uh, what's it like now? Read this, okay? Okay. Com committed. I know I'm not going to finish it. Right, 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 right. I'll have to be accountable. What state of mind is that? Come on. Oh, God. It's Come on, awful. describe that. It's like, um, it's like being chained down. Yeah, that's right. Chains. Ch yeah, chains. Right, more, more, more. And um, I can't move. Can't move. And I can't even think about moving because it's so impossible. So, I can't, so I'm, I'm chained psychically too, physically and psychically. And it seems like really the worst. I'd rather die than live through that. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> And it's like just a creation of my own making here. Oh, that's a, yeah, that's called, uh, yeah, yeah, a counterattack. What did you just do? Just kind of... Dismissed it. Yeah, right. Right. So all of this, were, now you're dismissing. Yeah. Because after all, it's dangerous, isn't it? Well, look at look at this. Oh, well, see, by by dismissing it, then I can say, therefore, it's not worth it to take on the right, that right. commitment. Of course, because it just takes me to some right. silly yeah, yeah creation yeah, yeah. of my own. <laughs> but the thing you're right, the thing you're going to try to get away from, away with. I yeah. mean, away from is the them. trains. Can't move psychically, physically. Yeah. Right. You can't even think about moving. Yeah. It's not just the worst, but I'd rather die than go through this. Yeah. Hey, uh, what's that like again? Put some more words on. Where does it hit you physically? Kind of here. In the horror? Yeah. Right? It's like Where? a heavy... Heavy. Come on. And, um, uh, and also like can't breathe. Can't. It's so heavy on the chest, too. So I can't. Uh, Come on. Can't generate any thumos. It's, no thumos, kind of, right? Yeah, right. I'm kind of. It's blocked. Yeah, I'm blocked. Yes. Yeah, so yeah, 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 yeah. Get yeah. the breathing going and. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, how old are you? How old is that? Boy, I don't know. It seems like it's like that's always been there, but how early can you trace it? You know that feeling. I don't know. It seems like an adolescent, adolescence or something. Well, can't. Well, how early, adolescent? Like 15 or so? No, 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 that's true. That's when you saw it. That's when you mm. saw it. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Where does it go? That's when it occurred. Yeah. That was a very intense time it occurred. Well, in those scenes with, with my playing baseball, it was there. that I couldn't run around the bases as fast as I thought I'd be able to. So it was... When I was running, there was that sense of, I can't move, like... Yeah, yeah, when you're trying to achieve something. Right. Running at the bases. And I, th I thought I was excellent at baseball, so I thought all facets of baseball I should be good at. Yeah. But I wasn't good at the running part. Yeah. So yeah, it's yeah, yeah. Is, is that because you gave up? Well, it did lead to that. Yeah. That feeling led to yeah. Yeah. my yeah. giving yeah. it up. So that's when you saw it. Uh, got an earlier one? Ooh. 
See, that's when it manifests for you, not for you to see it. And, and it often happens in schools. Uh-huh. Well, the baseball one was when I was about... away from home. Yeah. The baseball one is when I'm about 9 or 10. Pardon me? 9 or 10 for the baseball one. That's okay. Okay. Um, hmm. So it must be earlier than that. See, that's when you experience the can't move, right? Can't move or fast enough, right? Right. But you see, that's true, that's here. But we'd like to get to this sense that this is the worst. I'd rather die than continue or experience what's going on. You called it heavy in your chest, short of breathing. Keep Uh this in mind now. Keep this in mind when you answer that question. Okay, so it's kind of the same feeling I had when I was outside playing with my friends and neighbors when I was about um, seven. Seven. Uh Uh-huh, and we'd be playing outside every night, and then at some point people would say, oh, let's go to somebody's house now and play there. And so I was always very afraid that people would want to come to my house and so I'd start, like, thinking... So you're right. Look, again, strategize. can't move. Yeah. Right? right? Can't allow them to come in. Right? right. Yeah, yeah. It shows itself again, so there must be an earlier occasion for it. Mm. Right, well, because, like, uh-huh. running wouldn't... The realizing that you don't run fast enough for yourself, uh-huh. that's not going to understand this state of mind. It does answer, in one way respect, what you have said about your present, uh-huh. but not causative. That's why we're pushing it. Okay, so then there was that Christmas event when I was four. Well, okay, what I, happened? I got up on the stage in the church and I made a little speech and... Then everybody clapped, and I came down to join my mother and brother, and they were sitting in the pews, and there was no room for me there. And so there was a spot behind them. There was no room? Come on. uh, Yeah, so I think somebody pointed to a seat behind them, and I sat down, and... It was like I couldn't talk because everyone was shh. So it was like I felt a lot of like excitement and yeah. See, so you then sat behind them. Is that right? Yeah. How close? The behind next row? and over. Two. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. What was it like being behind them, looking at them? Come well, on. it was creepy because I, f- I felt like I had done this thing that everybody clapped for, but then I had to like hide immediately or be quiet immediately, and nobody said anything. And it was like I didn't know what really was what I, what I did or how I functioned. Yeah, nothing was said. Right. And I don't think anything was said later either. What? I don't think anything was said later. No. So I never really could integrate no, what, yeah. You could, yeah. what I that did. That ended your yeah. career on the stage. <laughs> yeah. Right? What are they doing? Well. What would you call it? What do you say they're doing? I felt like I was just being used. Like they they used me like a fork or a knife or something and then I just got thrown in the sink and yeah that's yeah that was their doing put you up on the stage yeah yeah and now it just showed again that you're just being used right yeah 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 right yeah like it was so you got an image of where we're there at no life in it 
Yeah, no life, right? Yeah. Right. right. And they're also rigid. Are they not? Yeah. Yeah, no move. Right. There's yeah, no yeah, move. Yeah, movement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yes, you see, you're coming again. Yeah. But not that we can see this can't be the worst and it can't be, I'd rather die than go through it. And that's where this is. Look, at that's right. where this goes. Yeah. Okay, what I'm yeah. saying is that this state of mind state of mind, right, uh, must have occurred earlier than four years old, or this scene mm. does show the same already don't move, can't move, rigid, right, nothing is going on, right, can't go any further, blah, blah, that's not this. Mm. So therefore we always ask, Oh, that's interesting. Is it possible you can go further? Or anywhere you want? Just forget that. W where does this bring you as you reflect on this? In your childhood? Um, that's the heavy breathing. Heavy breathing, chest. blocked, uh, right. chest and heavy on the chest, right here. And yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Go ahead. And this can get worse, can't it? In your experience. Well, it has, but not. Yeah. Yeah. You know, well, if I, if I stay in the diaphragm breathing, yeah. it's okay. Yeah. But um, I don't, I don't, nothing comes to, to mind. Well, all the, just, okay. Then uh, you have these sets of feelings. They, in fact, can get worse. Is that right? Um, the, the, um, Remember when you said, I'd rather die? At that moment, yeah, you, few, right, uh -huh. you had an insight into this state that you call being the worst, right? Yeah. Yeah, put words on it. Well, I feel like just such a failure. And What's that like, though? Like really low, and um, I can't... I can't account for myself. I can't account for why I didn't finish What's the, Come on. See, I can't account for myself not finishing. Mm -hmm. You see, you're quite right. Through this whole talk, this is blocking you from finishing, right? See, it's blocking you from finishing. Yeah, because I'm assuming this is going to happen. Yeah, and yeah, it's like yeah. I don't want that to happen so. because it's likely to be similar to this terrible scene. Yeah. 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 Really. Um. Mm. Well, it's kind of, I, I don't know, it's kind of like the scene with my mother. When? You know, when, I, when we were up at the lake yeah, shore go ahead. in Minnesota and at my aunt's cabin, and I came running into the cabin and was trying excitedly to tell my mother something. And she wasn't looking at me, or she was talking to my aunt. And um, nobody said anything, and I just kept saying, Mommy, mommy, I want to tell you something. Or, and finally, my aunt looked at me and said, "Just go sit over there 
on that couch or we'll throw you to the bears. So it was like so like being hit down or something. And um, I don't know if I even remembered what it was I was going to tell her after that. Of course that. not. Yeah, yeah. By the way, uh, what, do you, what do you make of the fact that uh, your mother was silent? Well, I think she had a life problem. She had some issues that she was in need of money and was getting money and support from her husband's sister there. And um, I think she was feeling this in this state herself. Oh. And couldn't even Hey, that's interesting. Look at me. You recognize this state that you're talking about. Yeah. That's her state. That's her state, yeah. Yeah. Okay, great. Right. Yeah. Right, right, right. In fact yeah. yeah. Why that's her state. Yeah. Yeah. When? Well actually I remember her being on the floor once. Her husband, my father hit her and she kind of, I think they were both drunk and she yeah. was like on the stairs and I put my hand down to lift, pull her up and she says, no, I belong down here. And it was that kind of down low. Yeah, I belong stuff. down here. Yeah. In fact, she's sharing with you, right? Yeah. Right, I belong down here. How did she look? She looked very... Forthright. I mean, right. she hey. never was that clear. Forthright. <laughs> hey, she's telling you, sharing a truth with you. Yeah. Yeah. And responding to, to my right. behavior. She wasn't yeah. even that responsive yeah. either. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. But she probably got hit because she was speaking her mind to him. Yeah. Yeah. And, yeah. Um, and so basically, it's disasters all the way around when you speak your mind. Yeah. Hey. Uh, that's this stuff, isn't it? Look at this. I belong down here. Yeah. Is that what this is also saying? Well, yeah, because by saying that, then. It was my cue to just leave, walk away. Right. But if she had come up, then I might have asked, what happened? <laughs> yeah, what do you think of the fact that her statement, you're a living? Right. Yeah, I am. Well, you're a good student. <sighs> Hi. By the way, see if you can do this. Would you agree you found that she was in an interesting state of mind? Come on. Forthright, you said? Yeah. Come on, more. Oh, oh, well, with the with her husband on the stairs, but with the aunt, she was low. She, yeah, she was yeah. Um she wasn't saying anything with the aunt. Look at her. She not wasn't saying anything, we're same thing. Come on. She wasn't looking at me at all. Yeah, come on. Does she fit this? Yeah, she fits that. Yeah, and they're not moving. And now she's telling you the reason this is going on, because I belong down there. Right, right. Yeah, right. And she said it forthrightly? Yeah. Clear? Like she was knowing? Yeah. Come on, more. Clear. Come on. And you know, I thought to myself, no, hey, there she is. even if this isn't true, she feels it so much at that moment right. that it's, she right. wants to be there. So She wants to be there, right. She does want to be there. Yeah. But look here, have yeah. you ever, look here, would you agree this is an unusual state of mind for her to be in? Forthright, clear, right? Uh -huh. Appearing knowledgeable, right? Yeah. Yeah, this is a high point, isn't it? Yeah. Rare. Yeah. Right. Exactly. Hey, she looks, then it's believable. Yeah. Yeah, somehow that was part, that was the, right. this was 
Yeah, it was yeah. like a drama. But yeah, she's making it believable. She's making it, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. By the way, did you think the teaching is true? No. No. Oh, you mean that you've been conned? You mean this is all a fraud? Yeah. What? Yeah. What does that mean? Well... Hmm. Well, it's just, yeah. What does that mean? Well, it means she can be, she can play this role of being like if she's non-participating. Part- yeah. She yeah. can just lay there and say, oh, I belong down here. That yeah, probably yeah. And is get she, away with that. Is she playing a role? Yeah. You saw that, or you're seeing now she's playing a role? Yeah. What do you mean, yes? I don't know what that means. Well, at the time I... I bought it. I mean, yeah, I the time you bought it. But it was like a weird buy. It was like, okay. Like she said it so passionately and clearly. Yeah. It was like, okay. But but now I'm seeing that she... What does that mean for you seeing now that that's not true? Well, it's like how I function. I function at a very low level. On her, for her, right. For, for myself in terms yeah. of... Yeah, look here, there it is. And I kind of think I belong down there, yeah. You're like your mother. Yeah. Yeah. Because I don't belong up there. That's right, <laughs> right. Therefore... Right. right, you think that's bullshit? Uh, Are you copying her? Is this a copy model again? Yeah. yeah. She looks so great, it must be true. Yeah. Are you suggesting it's false? Then what she should have done instead of, I belong down here. If you could say something to her now, what would you have said? Hey, Mom, finish it. Hey, Mom. Quit the act. Get up and be yourself. (laughs) Get a a life, Mom. Yeah. Get away from that guy. Yeah. Which is what I'm going through right now with. That's my what you're doing? Yeah. Trying to just be my own person, yeah. doing my own good work. That's right. Yeah. Good. Yeah. By the way, yeah. uh, the earlier parts of the dream, Yeah. Uh, would you agree <laughs> you're building a house in the wrong place? <laughs> I gotta look at that. <laughs> All those wild animals. Yeah. But at least... But you and Tony are building it. Well, there's something there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you can see it, I, I right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, thanks, Pierre. Okay. <laughs> sure. Uh, could you read it aloud? Yes. <coughs> All right. I think there's more copies up there if anybody doesn't have one. Is that right, Elder? Yeah. On the book? I was just saying, there's more copies up here if anybody doesn't have one. I was really full of energy when I arrived there. When I get there, Gary B is setting up, he's preparing, opening shop, so, so to speak. I stand up on the edge of the fence because he's on the other side, and I'm like, hey man. And he's like, how you doing, how you doing? And I tell him, man, this is crazy. It's crazy how when I do what I most want to do, I don't even get tired. Like, my energy just keeps going up and up and up. It's like, what the fuck? Uh, He's like, yeah, like every understanding. Oh, uh, he's like, yeah, like very understanding, like he gets it. Man, it's just like, yeah. Uh, Listen, do you know about J-Lo? Do you think it's true that she's getting heat from the media? 
And I'm like, before or after that, that thing that happened? Uh, he says, after. I'm like, well, yeah, not everybody gets it. Not everybody understands the situation properly. So, of course, they suspect her. And he's like, hmm, looking very thoughtful. We're talking as he's organizing stuff, pulling out chairs and whatnot. Uh, as he's walking around the corner, he asks me, are you happy to talk today? Because there are going to be a lot of people here that are looking forward to seeing you. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, for sure. Then we're in the place where the meeting is being held, and a lot of people have arrived. One of the people, a nice guy I was hanging out with yesterday, is there. As I walk past him, I'm like, hey, man, and we high-five each other. Uh, I jump up to look over this fence, and there's all this sauce spilled onto the middle of a table tennis table. And I'm like, wow, <laughs> already? Because this has happened before. And I think it's funny that they can't not spill the sauce onto that table. So now the meeting has started, and Gary asks the group some kind of question like, do you guys like marijuana? Or, or something like that, which is uh, illegal. And everyone is like, yeah, yeah. And even the three police women that are part of the group are like, yeah, yeah. And I'm laughing at them saying yes. Then Gary is like, okay, well, we're going to start with you, Mary, one of the police women. Uh, you're in the third. Uh, you're, you're in the fourth. You're in the fourth hypothesis. So I just need you to read this sentence uh, as he's pointing at his page. Mary is like, oh, no, I don't, I don't think I want to do this. And Gary is like, well, just this is you right here. This one sentence you got to acquaint yourself with. Uh, you got to acquaint yourself with that. And she's like, mm, looking at the sentence. Um, what do you make of the string? I don't know. Uh, no? I like it. Oh, good, good, good. I really like it. Yeah, yeah. I, I like that this guy, Gary, is in it. The Gary guy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So. What is, uh, any particular paragraph you like more than others? I like it when he says that, um, when he asks me if I'm going to talk and that people are going to be happy that I'm going to be there. I like that one. Um, that's the second paragraph? Yeah. Makes me feel very welcome. Right, that's a nice high state, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. Would you read the last paragraph, please? Then Gary is like, okay, well, we're going to start with you, Mary, one of the policewomen. You're in the third. You're in the fourth. You're in the fourth hypothesis. Uh, so I just need you to read this sentence as he's pointing at his page. Mary is like, oh, no, I, I, don't, I don't think I want to do this. Gary is like, well, just, this is you right here. This one sentence, you've got to acquaint yourself with that. And she's like, hmm, looking at the sentence. Now, what do you make of that? Um, well, I think his, uh, his, his method is a little crass. Hmm. The way that he's... Um, he wants to uh, help Mary to mm -hmm. understand her problems mm -hmm. and to um, to understand the fourth hypothesis. But I think, even though it's it's a good thing, I think he's a little bit um, he's a little bit I don't know intense about it, a little bit crass. I would say crass. 
Um, and also he seems to be not really sure. First he says the third, and then he says the fourth. Mm -hmm. So it's a bit, mm -hmm. it's a bit weird. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, what is he doing? How is he functioning and how it, you're watching this going on, right? So what do you make of that? Come on, here you are. He's like... Um, He's a he's like a teacher. He's like a he's like a teacher, with, right? Like a lecturer, like a yeah. Go ahead. Mm. And uh, name. How is he functioning? Like a what? Well, he's 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 a bit like a midwife. Well, how much like a midwife? Most excellent or what? I wouldn't say most excellent. Well, what would you, what would you say? I don't know, like. Five out of ten. <laughs> Fifty percent. Yeah. 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 Which is still pretty good. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, <clears throat> you're watching this taking place, aren't you? Yeah. What's it doing to the girl? Um. She gets she gets scared at first. Yeah. Um, then he then he shows a little bit of empathy and then she she's a little bit more willing but she's still hesitant hesitant at best. Um, is she hesitant or is she saying something? Come on. Well, first she says no. No, she says no. Yeah. And then she says, hmm. Right? So, what's he doing? Um, well, he's, he's being forceful. Oh, forceful. Yeah. More. Um, crass. Crass. Crass is a good word. Yeah. Right? yeah go ahead. Crass. That's, that's kind of what he's like in person. Yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> and you're watching this scene going down, right? right? Yeah. 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 yeah what do you say? What do I say? Yeah. Nothing. Oh. <laughs> What's that like? Come on. What's it like? You're yeah. watching. Hey, you see the guys going at fifty percent going, right? Hmm. Yeah, I could have done that better. And how? Yeah. What's happening? What well, state of mind is that? So you're watching it. What's that like? It's um it's it's like being pulled in two directions. Oh. Um, God, what's that like? It's really uncomfortable. It's I a, don't know uncomfortable. <laughs> it's 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 agony actually. Ag an agony. God, agony. More. It's um, it's like it's like being in a boiling pot. What? <laughs> it's like being in boiling water. That helps because it, it gets it gets worse um, as the the longer I stay in that state. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It gets worse the it's longer like a, I stay. It, it's kind of like it's kind yeah. of like being pregnant in a bad way. <laughs> yeah. Not that I know what a good yeah. way is like. But yeah, yeah, yeah. When it gets worse, what's it like? Um. Uh, in my stomach, it's like um, it's all like tangled and mm, tangled is a good word. Tangled, okay. tangled. But how does it make you? What's the effect it has on you? I become a mute. I become mute. Like, 
But shut you up. Move. Yeah. Right? Yeah. I like that expression you used before. I could have had. I could have. I could have done better. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know that. Yeah. What's it like knowing you could have done better, but you're stuck? Mm. Mute. That's really bad. It's like... Hmm? It's really bad. It's... Um, It's really um, uh, Buddha. I, I don't know the name. <laughs> What's his first name? Buddha what? <laughs> no, bitter. <laughs> like. Um, Go ahead. Uh, what is it like? Feels like um, like I'm um, uh, di disabled. Disabled. Yeah, too many letters. Yeah. Disabled. I'll write it down. But um, right. It's an agony. Remember how you put it? It's an agony. It's being pulled in different directions. Right. And I'm mute. And it's bad. I'm disabled. And it can get worse. The longer I stay in it, it gets worse. So what we're looking for are words that might describe this state of mind better than you have here. That's what we're doing. So, so I'm asking, like, can you put more words on this, or is, if this is enough? It feels like I'm poisoned. Like, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's, they, they're not. I, I can see that they're not really describing the state of mind, but. No, I can use that. That's good. It's like um, I'm not saying anything. I'm pointing. Oh, yeah. Um, no, no. Um, poison. Poison. Oh, poison. Yeah. Ah, better. <laughs> Poisoned. <clears throat> oh. Um, poison. <laughs> decaying. Decaying is a good word. Just another word, decaying. Decay. Uh, like rotting. Okay, all right, I'll use it, DK. Right. <laughs> poison! Poison! It's a, it's a uh, <laughs> Japanese term. Right, come on. It's poison, disabling, decaying, right? It could get worse, it could get bad. Hey, I'm angry, and it's like being pulled in different directions. How old are you? You know that state. It's been around for a long time. Yeah. I know it recent. I know I can remember it recently, but... Um, I mean, I, I spent... I spent a lot of time in that state mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. at home when when I was around my parents. Uh, That's right. Probably. Yeah, that's when, why it's worth figuring out. Yeah, go ahead. When when my dad when my dad is. Um, talking, 
He talks in a similar way to this guy. As Gary. Gary. Yeah, so you're looking at someone like your dad, your father. Yeah. Right? And, um, the, and you're saying something just or unjust. Well, unjust. Yeah, 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 but, um, yeah, 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 yeah. It was it was always like uh, when he was when he was talking in that way, it was very theatrical and yeah. very animated. Wow. That and that gave it some kind of power, uh, but but it was um, it was ju just like him. It wasn't. Yeah. It yeah, wasn't always yeah, good, yeah, yeah. and see, and seeing him in that state would yeah. put me in that state. Yeah, good. Yeah. That's right. Fine, fine. That's good. See, fine. Seeing this, I experience this. Right. It's like w when my when guests would come over to the house, uh, and my dad is like entertaining them. Um, that's when he would be in this. Um, yeah, sure. Mode. And yeah. Then, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. kind of quiet in the background. Right. 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 Um. Um. See, I stay in that state in my room, especially um, when I'm around my parents, right? Is that right? Yeah. Right? So, you stay in that state, right? Go for your own room, get into your own room, and do you leave them? Um. Can you leave when he's in that state? Or must you be there and witness it? I, I can leave. I can leave. Yeah. I mean, it I, wasn't essential. But yeah, yeah, I can. Yeah. I can go. So out it's done for your. Yeah, you're a vital member to this. Doing it in front of you for you for your benefit. Right. It's his best side, isn't it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, and it, it leaves a really bitter but, taste on, in my yeah, mouth. Come on. Does he look like he knows? At these moments? He does, yeah. Right? Come on, a knower? Yeah. Right? It's, it's, it's weird because... Um, Come on, uh, definite? Yeah. Right? Come on. Um, Powerful? Alive. Alive? Come on. Um, You're saying, hey, in a high state, this is a high state. Yeah, it is. That's why I can't. Yeah. I can't. Yeah. I, that's why I couldn't challenge it. Yeah. It, <laughs> even though I always felt there's something off. Oh, well, there is something off, there right? Is, it's unjust. It, it definitely is. Yeah. <laughs> Apart from that, it's great. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Um, yeah. See. We don't have yet what we need. We want to know in a scene where you re-experience this, hey, angry, pulled in different directions, right? Right? The longer I stay there, the worse it gets. It's really bad. I end up feeling and acting as a mute, right? Decaying, right? This is poison. See, that had to come independent of this and before it, most likely, for you. So how are you? Come on. Uh, uh. You've been in this state. Okay, now watch now. We're not talking about this state now. We got that. 
We're talking about what it's like when you experience this state of mind. Angry, pulled in different directions, right? It's bad, it's poisonous, it's feeling a decaying. Well, where does that come from in your past? The, the thing I remember is um, when I was six, seven. Oh, good, good. Um, my dad hit my mom. Oh. And um, we... I, I didn't see it. No, okay. I didn't see it, but um, I, I was... My, my dad and I left the apartment for some reason. We left the house, uh, and he was telling me what happened. Ah, then this is your retold, okay. Yeah, he, he was telling me what happened. Right. Um, I don't know if he told me that he hit her, or if my granddad told me, or... I don't, I'm not sure, but he, my, my dad was justifying it to me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, why that happened. And um, I, f I felt that there was an injustice, but I didn't, I didn't say anything. Mm -hmm. uh, there was something really wrong with that yeah, situation, yeah, and yeah. I was... Yeah, right, right, right. I was just kind of listening to my dad's... Yeah, see, this is another, see, the relationship between these. Injustice, injustice, right? Yeah, so, um, pick another one. That's good. That shows it reappeared here. Is it because, look here, you see, because it's the same as this. You're seeing another, something unjust, right? He's trying to justify it, but you can't say anything? Mm -hmm. I think, um, I don't know if this is, hmm? I don't know if this is the same state. I don't, it doesn't but, matter. Um, I think I was like three, maybe. No, no. Um, my parents left me and my cousin alone at home. Uh, older or younger than you? Uh, older. He was maybe five. And I was three. Uh, and they left us alone with these chicks. These very small uh, small chicks in a, yeah. bo in a box. Yeah. Uh, yeah. In yeah. Incubator, I think. Uh, and... Um, we were playing with them, and the box fell, and they ran everywhere. <laughs> they, they were scattered all over the house and running away. And, um, I think we were, we were having a good time with it until my parents came home. And then um, they were, like, really angry at us. They were yeah. angry at us, like we had done something really bad. Right. Um, like, how could you? Um, how, how could this happen? How could you? How could you do this? That kind of um, theme. And um, I think I felt that way there. Because I mean, no, you're now can't answer. But he's showing anger. Is he showing anger or not? Is he just straightforward? Is he playing this role? Hmm? It, it may have been my mom that... Go ahead. Try it with your mother. Go ahead. ...that um, was like scolding us. Maybe both of them. See, um, um, what's it like? Come on, 
uh, at that moment, they're asking those questions. What's it do to you? Well, I, I didn't understand why, like, why are they angry at us when they left us with the ch chicks and, like, we were having fun and we didn't, I didn't see that we did anything bad. But I was made to feel really guilty for the Well, thing you're made happened. to feel guilty. See, you were asked a question, right? What did that do to you? Come on. You were asked a question. Come on. Could you answer it? Um, well, I, I'm, I, I don't know if they actually asked that question. That's just the. Oh. That's just as as well as I can. Okay. Describe their reaction. It was more like that wasn't really a question. It was more like, you did something bad. That this is bad. Yeah, it's. Okay. It's like, how could you do this? It's well, not. That's your you mother. Um, like, did they ask you any questions? As you can rec add in terms no. of. You, at this point, you're saying it may not be a question. No, no, there wasn't any question. Like, it may have been put as a question. No, no, I need, it would be it worthwhile, a it, it's good if that it was put that way. Oh. Would be, would this is the way they would talk? Is this typical of him or her? Hey, what's going on? Hey, how can you do this? Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, it's um, there's a there's a Bosnian expression which is. So, so I have a curious question. What is it like not being able to answer those questions? What does it do to you? What did it do to you? I was really confused. I was really confused and. And guilty, I felt really guilty because they're like, uh, like they're see, there are two things that are wrong. One is you're not answering the question, and the other you cause the chicks to scatter. Mm. But see, it's it's not a question. It's just <coughs> it's it's more like expressing anger in the in in saying a question. It's not like. It's more like, it's not, it's not, uh, how could you do this? It's, how could you do this? Thank you. It's like that. Yes. So it's... Yes, that's an urgency. I mean, that makes it even more confusing. Yeah, but because, how can you do this? Come on, yeah, do it again. It's like, how could you do this? It's like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And come on, <laughs> what does that do to you? I was scared. Huh? I was scared. Scared? Yeah. Well, why don't you answer it? Because you left me with the freaking chicks. Of course I'm going to play with them. I'm a three-year-old boy. <coughs> That's, you didn't answer the question. How can you say, how, how can you do this? <laughs> because it was fun. Huh? Because it was fun. Is that what you told him? No, I didn't say that. Why didn't you say that? Yeah, that would have been something. What? <laughs> that would have been something. That would have been what? That would have been something. That would have been amazing. Why? Well, because it's... Because you'll be breaking out of being mute. Yeah. I would be... So come on, answer it now. What do you think of that? What do you think of the question? Uh, how, I think, how could I not do this? <laughs> I mean, it's like... Um, 
It's like you, you leave me with these cute, like, amazing creatures. And how, I look here, how is it possible that you do such a thing? Because I, I like cute chicks. <laughs> <laughs> You're not answering the question. How can you do it? How? How? Uh, I mean, playfully and with with fun and with I mean, with my cousin and. You're not doing very well. Why not? Well, is that because you answered the question? I think so. Good. You say it the way you said it a moment ago. How can God do it again? It's like, how could you do this? I could do it because you left us alone and I like playing with the chickens. Does that answer? Yeah. For her or him? I think it was my mom. Okay, your mom. I think it was my mom. Yeah. Because you left us alone with them. Hmm. Like, what do you expect? Well, I don't know. Did someone ask the question? Yeah, it's yours, not mine. Yeah, th that's what I'm. That's what I'm saying to my mom. Like, of course. What do you expect? Of course, we're going to do this. Yeah, but at that time, you couldn't say that. No. Yeah, no. yeah, yeah. yeah. What if you had said to her, Hey, Mom, I've noticed since I've been around this world that very few people can answer how or why they do anything. <laughs> that would have really made her angry. Right? Probably. Yeah. See, these are traps. These yeah, are that's traps. Yeah, a trap, yeah. These are traps. They're ancient traps. Pull it on kids all the time. It's great. Hey. It can't be answered. Say, why are you doing that? Shit, I'm supposed to know why I'm doing that. <laughs> right, right, yeah. I don't even know how to answer that question. Yeah. I don't even know why the, you have to water the plants, let alone... Yeah. How. <laughs> yeah, that is a trap. That is a trap. And you fell in it. That's a really clever trap. Oh, it's a good one. Oh, yeah, it's time honored. Uh, by the way, what could you have asked her in response? Well, if you if you didn't want the chicks to be released, why did you leave them with two infants? Well, you could have asked her, hey, Mom, have you ever answered a question like that? <laughs> right. Yeah. <laughs> Has anybody ever asked you a question like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they, they trapped you, huh? What do you think of the fact that you've been trapped? and reduced to silence. That's, that's huge. Yeah, 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 that's what I thought. Good dream. What are you going to do about it? Good. Put it on my wall. <laughs> <laughs> Pleasure. Thank you. Pleasure. Hold it. I, um, I had a question about this, Pierre, because it's... I had, I had a... It's very similar to Elgar's. I had a talk with you recently that went back to a past scene, and my father asked a very similar question. How do you know? Right? And it's, it's every bit a trap as well. But the way that you put it to me at the time, and it seems it's true of Elgar's as well, is that even though these kinds of questions are traps, 
There's also a really elegant beauty at the core of them, almost like they're a koan that we're left with. Absolutely. Because it is a koan. It's a koan, right? So Absolutely. Let me ask you, does every path of logos have at its core a koan? Yeah. Of course. So you can turn the trap around and, Absolutely. and explore the, the beauty. Hey, that's a great question, right? Yeah. How do any of us know? Yeah. That? yeah. But could you but so, really, say, why are you saying what you're saying? <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I know. I, I, got, a, I got an answer. <laughs> well, but see, the thing is, is, it seems to me that we often say that to really master the path of logos, you have to put a label on the other person's role, on their behavior, yeah, okay. right? Yeah. But it seems to me that just as powerful is to get to the core koan. Is yeah. it not? Yeah. More again. Just as powerful yes. is to get to that core koan. True. Because now you've just totally dispersed yeah. that trap yeah. and turned it into yeah. the fun. The fun. Here. Uh -oh. Should have invited my mom for a <laughs> sitting session. Let's yeah. sit on this. <laughs> David. This seems derivative and after all your hard work and everything, but it seems like the best way to communicate a path of logos is to take something that's completely clear, obvious, and rational and turn it into something that's irrational and then convince the object of the path of logos, that that's rational. Mm. I mean, like, it's obvious and clear that uh, the chickens are going to go crazy. Yeah. And, and there's no, like you said, there's no other explanation. Um, and, and yet, uh, to put it in, in, in a cast in a language that makes it seem irrational completely confounds mm -hmm. the clear and obvious situation. That's right. Or getting hit. That's or right. any other thing. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's powerful. To take something rational and turn it into something yeah. irrational. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, how could you possibly turn it on her and ask, how could you leave me alone where I could even do something like that? Hold it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's... Louder? That would be, like, too much for, for me to... Like, I, I would be calling her out on too much. Yeah, exactly, and you can't dare to do that. It's better to right. bring you deeper into shit. Because she's right. so wrong. Like, she couldn't be any more wrong. Right, exactly. Okay. How could that be calling somebody out on too much? That's, you know, I guess because you're young, because you're inexperienced, you don't have the, the, the bargaining power. It's because of what you said, because it's so irrational. Because it's like, you're convinced that the rational, somehow they have to turn it into being irrational. Like, the, the, mm. it being so rational is like the condition for that irrational thing to happen. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. But if you turn it back on them and say, well, why did you leave us with a three? You, you're already asking them a why question. You're playing the same path of logos getting back at them. But Jeff had a different idea of, instead of doing that, um, instead of playing that same back game back, well, you ask me a why, well, why don't you? Blah, blah, blah. I mean, it might give you a bit of joy to get one up in the game, but Jeff's idea was to find the co-one that we can both share in and participate in a more energetic way, rather than continuing the cycle of that way. Yeah, like, like in my father's case, it was great, because Pierre says to me, uh, he had me go through this, and I, I failed about 25 times too. I'm like, what would you say to Dad, right? What is the right answer to this? But in the end, it's a total mystery. How the heck do you know, right? How do I? Hey, and, but, but the way you put it, Pierre, was like, you know, you could, you could invite Pop to explore that mystery with you. Hey, yeah, how do we know? And have a big laugh about it, right? If you can go there. Mm -hmm. Very liberating. See, at that very moment, they have to look yes. their best. They even have to go further than look their best. They have to make that statement sound like it's utterly rational. Mm -hmm. Right? Turn yeah. the rational and irrational. Yeah. Right? The, the, the statement itself is irrational. They have to give it so much, mm. pour energy into it to make it look pretty profound, right? <laughs> it's like the whole being is the whole. It's on the line. 
That's why at those moments, if you could ever have the courage or the insight to say, hey, can you answer a question like that, Mom, or Dad? <laughs> that would end it, wouldn't it? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> but we can't do that. No, that's why he's muted. Right. He knew he could. He had to grow up and... He'd in her face. Pardon me? No way you can do that. That, goes back, that, that makes it go yeah. back further. Where did you learn that? That's young. Yeah, it seems like there would have to be something before that to teach me to act that way. Yeah. No, yeah. No. Okay, next one. Elder, were they in a box? <laughs> yeah, like a big cardboard box. And what did you do with the box? Didn't you, didn't it I don't know, I guess it just fell over. Whose is this? Um, Your neck. Well, come on, let's do it. Well, I have to question wrong. I'm wondering about how it was. I fell over, right? Yeah. I was wondering. Okay. Um, I was at B and B's house, and they were reading. I listened to the reading, which there was <clears throat> not much said about it. There was a small shepherd dog. It was friendly, and then people left. I was reading some book that B wrote. It had pictures in it. In reading it. I saw some parts were good, others could be improved. I was noticing some people, I figured they were family members. They had two kids. I thought of asking them to come over, but I stayed with the reading. Then I got ready to leave. I looked for my shoes, my slippers. I found them, but I felt embarrassed that I fumbled with them. Then I walked out. It was late. I was walking and met Jay. She was walking her dog and going home. She had a new dog. It was friendly. I said, great dog. Uh, she said it was her third dog. And I had said, great, I had said earlier, great second dog. Then I remembered an anxious dog, but she gave it away. This one was great. So this was the third dog. I went into her trailer house. She was cooking, and suddenly I saw this huge shepherd dog out of her window that was across the street. I worried about it being hit, but it was huge. I mentioned to Jay. She said it was not huge. I said it looks like it went to see the skeleton hanging, and it should have been hanging in a patio. I looked at the dog and saw that it was bigger than I had seen it. Jay was hesitant. Then she said B&B &B had two dogs. I asked, what for? Jay said it was a dog that doesn't bark. It just sleeps outside. I wondered why. They already have one. So again I asked. I said they needed to value... Jay said they needed to value their boundaries. I'm saying, but you know, what's the big secret? It's all secrets. I got angry with the boundary issue. You guys don't know what boundaries are and what they mean. You think you know and you make up some idea of boundary, but you don't know. I left Jay. I closed the door behind me. She yelled thanks as I apparently shook her tr food tray. I didn't slam the door. I just closed it tightly. But because it was closed, as, I, uh, as it was left it had been a jar when I had come in. She was upset I closed it. She thought I was mad. I was disgusted at their ignorance. I left and wondered about the dog. I thought the smaller one must be for B and his medical problems and the big one for protection of the house. B and B don't come out much, but B has this other dog for, let's see, but B has the other dog. I don't know. I still wasn't satisfied about this big dog and what was it and why was he there? It was huge. Okay. What do you make of this? What do you Well, uh, I noticed something about the whole dream and uh, especially the first part. It was very bland. In fact, most of it was bland. And that seemed to stand out. Like there wasn't anything, except when I got angry about the mm -hmm. boundary, mm -hmm. most of it was just mm -hmm. 
Except and when I saw the dog. Yeah, that's different when you saw the dog. When I saw the yeah, dog, yeah, yeah. and um, but that stood out even more than me getting upset about boundaries. Yeah, yeah. But it related to the dog, so yeah, yeah. it was like <clears throat> they had the dog and and was keeping it secret. Mm-hmm. And it was a huge dog. Mm-hmm. Really fine looking dog, but huge. Yeah. How do you see yourself in, in this dream oh. functioning? Um, well, I'm observing. Hmm? I'm observing a lot of things. Um, I'm not really, um, I'm not really engaged in that sense. I'm not... Engaged. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, uh, later you are, are you not? Yeah. I mean, I address what I see, but... Yeah. Um, I'm doing some things, but like I'm reading uh, the book... I notice things about it. I don't say anything about it mm-hmm. to anybody. That I think that's a big issue. I didn't cons- think of that. I get. <clears throat> I, I start noticing other people instead. Okay. And then I get caught up in dogs. Right. Right. right, right. What's the issue with the dogs in the dream? Well, there's two of them. One is that. Um, B has one dog and then J comes along and she Ah. got another dog she got three dogs and I was upset about the anxiousness just wonder whether you read one thing for me All right. Um, third paragraph I asked what, yeah, good. Uh, I, I asked, asked what for, and Jay said it was a dog that doesn't bark. It just sleeps outside. Then and I going. wondered why. Yeah. They already have one. Well, so, you're asking, come on. Well, why do they have a why? set? Why? Why? Well, you ever answer that? No. It wasn't answered. But what do you answer? What do you challenge? The issue of boundaries, agree? Oh, yeah, Jay said they needed to value their boundaries. Yeah. And I'm saying, but you know, oh, I see, I don't go back to why. Yeah, yeah, What's, what do you make of that? You have, a, you have a good question. And then you switch to mm-hmm. the issue of boundaries, do you know? Yeah, mm-hmm. Found that curious? Yeah, I wondered why right. it didn't bark. And yeah, you had a good question. And didn't I you? wondered why they had two dogs, and I wondered why it was sleeping outside. Well, I yeah. figure out that yeah, it was Yeah, a whole huge. bunch of questions, didn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Right. I see. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, what's it like when you come up with that question? All of them, come on. Bunch of questions, come on. What's it like that? Why? What's it do to you? In the dream. Like I was, um, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, like it was a question that just came out of me, almost like, what? Why? Why doesn't it bark? And why is it? 
uh, outside, and why do they have two? No, no. It was like... Okay. You're asking why. Mm -hmm. Why? A whole bunch of questions. What's that like when you're asking all of those questions and do anything about it? But rather pick on a secondary issue of boundaries. What's it like? Well, you're asking a question that's hard for me to capture, but I, I understand what you're asking. I said, you're asking a question, it's hard for me to capture what it's like. It's like... That's in the dream. It's, yeah, but it's like I'm... It's like fundamental. I don't know at that moment. It's just... where I was at. I wanted to know what, what this... It, it was important. Would you not agree we have a wonderful thing going on, right? That's a fundamental question. It came out of me. Yeah. Right. I wanted to know, right? Mm -hmm. And then you settle for a secondary issue. What's that like in the dream? To settle? Um, <laughs> well, it, it seems it seems more real than the question I had before. I mean, I dropped it, but it seemed more real. In that sense, it is more real. In what way do you mean that? Well, it was like, it was like attaching myself to an issue. Well, it was like attaching myself to an issue. rather than a why, which would be wondering about something, but it was like I'm, I'm attaching myself to but an, arg see, to an argument, to an issue. go for an issue, issue which seems more real. Yeah. Right? The, the, it, it seemed more real to be talking about boundaries and complaining and than it did... Uh, well, by the way, is it, is it likely because... Uh, um, Well, they said they... See, I got angry with the boundary issue. No, that Jay... Right? But oh, yes. Jay says, before that, go ahead. Jay said they needed to value their boundaries. That's his reasoning. What's right. it like when you heard that? I was angry. Come on. I'm saying, I'm, like, they need to value their boundaries, but it's like... Well, what's the secret? I mean, it's a huge dog. How can you hide something like that? It's almost contrary. So, so, um, okay, then... Uh, would you answer the issue of boundaries? Come on, notice no. now what happens. Come on. Well, I, I don't. You guys know. You guys uh, don't know what boundaries are and what they mean. Well, it doesn't look like I had. I did. You think you know, and you make up some idea of boundary, but you don't did you? know. Did, did I you answer? deal with the issue then? Um. Well, I thought I did. Well, I know, but did you? <clears throat> Um, well, I, uh, I thought I did. Yeah, I did. I, I'd say, yeah, I thought I did. But you're asking me, did I? I don't see that I didn't. If you're asking me that I didn't. Because you didn't find out what he means by securing his boundaries. That's true. Right? Yeah, 
and what they mean. And what they mean. Well, you guys don't know what boundaries are and what they mean. Well, I, did you, I, did I assumed you? that it was the secrets. I'm saying, but you know what's the big secret. It's all secrets. They value boundaries, meaning somehow the boundaries are that they were keeping the dog secret. Yeah, but see, you, sh you gave up. You why? gave up your question. Yeah, I wondered why. Which right. would have solved the issue of boundaries. And it seems more real. Yeah, the secondary issue. Asking about boundaries or yeah. being upset about boundaries. In other words, did yeah, you saw true. something weak about his answer. Well, my... Is that right? I, Your dream? Jay said they needed to value their boundaries. Yeah. Yes, I saw something weak about that. Yeah. It didn't seem right. No, 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 no. So I don't didn't, know how that This happens. didn't seem right, so do you offer any... I, think, I say that they just made some idea of what boundaries are. It doesn't make sense to me <laughs> at all. Well, we're in the dream. Yeah, well, I don't think I'm making sense in the dream either. Yeah, but you see, now you're caught up in this. Yeah. Right? Uh, you guys made up that idea, right? Yeah. You're upset at that. Yep. What happens to your... It, I never go back. To, well, wait a minute. Uh, I... Okay, that's enough. Okay. By the way, would you read the first two sentences? I was at B&B's house and they were reading. I listened to the reading, which there was not much of a set about it. There was a small shepherd dog. It was friendly. And then people left. Yeah. What did you see in that reading? That there was not much said about it. I listened to the reading, which there was not much said about it. Like there was not much said. And then you went on your own? Well, I was given an I was given another reading. Yeah. And I was reading it and looking at it myself. And you're saying what are you saying? That what well, there are two issues. Go ahead. Right. That the book that that B wrote, uh yeah. it was in parts there were good good parts, but then there were others that could be improved. What's that like? That's different for me. I wouldn't. I would never take that position. Well, I guess that I, I, not that strongly. I could. I could see that there would be uh, good parts, but to make the judgment that there were sections that could be improved would be kind of like a silent judgment. I wouldn't, I wouldn't overtly or consciously say, okay, that's what I'm going to say about this. Yeah, we're talking about the dreams now, remember? Don't slip out oh, of Oh, okay. Right? Yeah, yeah. You're saying that's something normally I wouldn't do. Yeah, You're in doing reading, it in the dream. Right, in, that's why we have the dream. In, in reading... What's it, it like at that moment? You see it can be improved. You're seeing the reading. It's good and I can see where it can be improved. It, I was clear. What? I was clear about what I was seeing. Clear. Come on, more. And um, I was... Uh, I was one. Clear. But um, it was like it was like I was given the book as if it was good completely. But I saw that it could be improved in certain sections. What is it like at that moment seeing that it could be improved? That I was well, I was 
being clear about it, but I was also being in contrast to why I was given the book, which would be that um, I wasn't given the book to critique. I was given the book to read. And that's when I saw, so I, I saw that it could be improved. And, and that was good feeling. I, could, I saw Look, that I was seeing see, something good. Let's get good. back in the dream. Okay, All right. read it again. Watch. I was reading some book that book B wrote. It had pictures in it. In reading it, I saw some parts were good, others could be improved. Right at that moment in the dream, what is that like? Uh, commanding, clear. Clear. Um, I, um, must be brain dead. I'll, I'll, st I'll stay with that one word if you want. Clear. Oh, that's good enough. All right, look here. So you like that state? Uh, Being clear? <laughs> kind of commanding, like I had a knowledge of how to make this judgment, and I wasn't doubtful about it, no, no doubt about what I was seeing. You like that state? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Nice state. Nice state. Yeah. What do you do with it? Oh, I go and look around the room to see about other people. That's right. Mm -hmm. From that point on, it's what? Distraction. Tangent. Right? Yeah. This whole thing is a tangent. <laughs> From why on? That's interesting. Yeah, because I never talk to B. I don't go back and point out what I saw. Nothing. Same with the question. So, with the dog. I'm not satisfied with this, okay? Would you mind telling me, I'm not sure about what these words mean. Not bashful, there's no doubt in it, certain knowledge, clear. Can you have something more to it? Like, what? I see that I, I'm good at reading the material. What's that like? And, oh, I saw that I was making these judgments not to be mean. It was like just a clear observation, a fair, a, a just one. Like I was being just about it but, and not being uh, super, not being mean-spirited. It was just. Well, it kind of adds to that state, doesn't mm -hmm. it? Huh? Yeah. So it's not just being clear. No, it was like no. feeling like I'm being fair. No. A and being fair to no. the situation. That's a, it's a rather good state. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Uh, uh, what do you do with it? <laughs> Tangent. Hey, that's right. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know any clue where this goes. Hmm. And you got picked up on a secondary issue? Same thing, yep, on the in terms mm -hmm. of the dog. Yeah. Um, Yep. That's very fast. Very mm -hmm. quick. Very, very quick. Mm -hmm. I don't see the the good and the beauty in that in the book or the um, or that question about the dog. See I get the, caught up in other things. See, all of that clarity didn't go along with this. Even though, hey, look, it may have may have gotten you into it, but it's a fundamental question. It came out of me. Uh, right? I wanted to know. Yeah. Right. This is the state of knowing. Knowledge. Clear. That's true. Right. Mm -hmm. But both were real good. Yeah. 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 This might have gotten there because you already experienced it here.
So therefore the problem is in responding to those people and the way in which you do. In the beginning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm, it really sucks. <laughs> All right. Okay. Yeah. Yep. So look here, what are we gonna say what are you gonna say about this? In a nice state and then you get caught up in that stuff? Well, the even though interesting. Yeah. But on a different level. Yeah, I would say that the reading of the book and making those judgments was much which much higher than the why question. I mean, the why question was good, but it was not in respect to the reading. Mm -hmm. Like I was asking about dogs and wondering about that, but that seemed to be further removed from this state. Mm. So, if you were to stay in this state, the fundamental state, that I one. want to know, mm. where does this go? Come on. Right? Can, see, it can admits of degrees. That one? Um, yeah. I think that's about as far as I go. That's about as far as I go. I'll ask a why, and that's it. Where it goes after that, I don't know. Well, because you abandon it. Yeah. Where would it go? <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> no, no. Hmm? Louder. <laughs> you got it. You're in the state, right? Well, I'm not capable of going beyond that. I can ask why, but that's it. And I can't go deeper. That's it. Yeah, 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 yeah. What's the state like? You're in it now. Right? You're in it now. What am I going to ask you, Jean? Um. You're in it right now. You don't have to describe it. You're in it. Right. Um. I just kind of ask myself why things go on at home. Like, why is my mother doing what she's doing? yelling and screaming, but I don't go any further with it. <coughs> I don't even ask her. That's, that's all I know. That's all I remember. See, look here, you got it. See, I can't go deeper. I'm not capable of going any further. Right? Hey, this is a path of us, right? Right. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Got the state of mind, what's that like? Um, just, uh, I, don't, what's the state of mind? Um, I just like, um, um, <laughs> it's like reaching the, my limit, or reaching lim my limit, that's as far as I can go. What's that like? Come on. Um, Come on. It's like my somebody What's that is, like? Well, it's like somebody putting um, a block on my head. What? A block. Well, I, I don't know what that word means. Come on. Um, like I'm up, I'm uh, uh, like a stone or block. Stones, not stones, blocks. More. Uh, cement blocks. Come on. On top of my head. On top of my head. Come on. Yeah, and I can't, I can't push them away. I can't get them out of my head. Right, right. What's that like? Come on. Um. What's it like? It's like. It's like blinding. I don't know. Like. Blind. Well, I mean, I'm, I, I'm blinded. I, I can't see beyond those blocks. I don't know what to do.
And the, the so effect I'm just that stuck. has on you, come on. The well, I just have to deal with the block. I just have to stay where I am. There's no way to get get around it or, or to push it away or... Can't go, can't go any further. It's not a stuck um, feeling as much as a hey, physical, hey, mental. How old are you? How old is this? I don't know. It's long. Hey, this, huh? Um. Well, it's pretty old. Um, I can't think of. I mean, like, I have several scenes, but the first one that came up was when I got a piece of coal in my stocking, but that was when I was nine. Mm -hmm. um, and I was just shocked and wondering, why did I get it? Mm -hmm. um, but that was it. Go more. And I didn't go any further than that. why. Just and it was actually to myself. Why did I get this? Because um, my mother was telling me, well, you weren't good this year. She was giving me the reason why I got the coal. What was it? Well, that was because of you're not good. You weren't good this year, and it was just to let you know that. And I had no we, no idea whatsoever what it was that she was talking about. And there was no way to get to the reality of what she was talking about. I could see that right away. I could see that it was just by what she was saying. I mean, like, what is it that I did? Is it the whole year? There's nothing. There was just nothing I could even ask her to be able to get the reality by what she was saying to me. Is there something earlier? Um, yeah, there's some others earlier. Uh, uh, what effect did it have on you? Come on. That time. I just remember that I was just um, like uh, I just knew I couldn't ask her anything. I couldn't. I couldn't go any further. I couldn't, what about couldn't. I couldn't go any further. I couldn't ask her nothing about it. I could have the question, but I couldn't ask her. I couldn't address it. I couldn't raise it. Nothing. Oh. So, um, you couldn't answer her. You're stuck. Why did that, I? That's terrible. That I was, totally agree with you. You were so, not good. So, that, excuse me. No, uh, I couldn't even ask her have, what did she ever, mean. Uh, studied son? Yeah. She gave you a call. On. Yeah. What did you do with it? Uh, I just believed that she was right. Yeah, is she? I have no idea what she was looking at. I don't, you think she's looking. right, though you couldn't figure out what she's looking at. Well, yeah, I, I understand. Yeah. No, she's not right because if what? she's gonna no. What do we know? Well, if she's gonna give me a piece of coal, she should have at least said, "Hey." Let me give you a piece of coal because you did this this past year. Wait a minute. This is a Christmas. Yeah. And this is your one gift. <laughs> a hunk of coal in, in a... In my stocking. In a stock. It's they not my one gift. They don't have to give you any gifts. They don't have to... You don't participate in anything. Boy, that's a good one. No, no. They gave me gifts, but that was the mark. But that was the... Oh, you got some gifts. I don't remember. Yeah, yeah. I got some gifts. Yeah. But that was the... I mean, the the gifts compared to that was yeah, yeah. I mean, it was Wiped like them out. getting yeah, it's like yeah. getting yeah. 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 had no meaning to me. Oh. That was the most meaningful. 
You know? I mean, that was my gift. Say, uh, what do you think of her answer? Do it again? You were not good this year. Answer it. Without a question, I would, I would have liked to have asked her what she was talking about. Why? She said, she told you right there what she's talking about. That's no good. For huh. the whole year, I wasn't good. What? For the whole year, I wasn't good. That didn't answer it. It's rhetorical. That's no good. What are you going to do about it? Come on. Um. Well, I guess I, I could have asked her what what she what. Well, I know I wasn't even close to that. Can't hear you. No, I just said that. Um, you know, like. I didn't even ask my question, like why did I get it? I just said, whoa, I must have done something awful, and I don't even know. You what believed it is. her. Oh yeah. Yeah, you believed her, right? I mean, I asked myself why did I get it, but I didn't go any further. I didn't ask her verbally. I was just well, shocked. Did, did you ask for evidence? I didn't ask her anything. But you believed her. Yeah. Well, yeah. What I mean, does that mean, you believed her? Well, if, if my mother gives me a coal in my sock, then there must be something. For her to even take the time to do that. I mean, like, why would somebody do that to somebody unless there was good reason for it? You're absolutely right, but you don't know what a good reason is yet. <laughs> well, I, I, yeah, I don't know what you mean. Why? Same thing. You believed her. So oh, what are you going to say right now? Come on. Not, I didn't even believe her. I was... No, well, right now, Before answer. she even said it, I agreed with her. Yeah, come on, answer it. Come on. Why did I get it? Come on, finish it. Uh, you were not good this year. Answer it. Uh, well, the whole year? I, well, I'd ask, are you saying the whole year? Because I remember doing some good things. Are you Pardon saying are those you are... Are you going to do it or not? Did that answer it? Well, see, I can't get... I can't, I can't do it. I can't face her in that sentence. I don't know what to ask. I don't know what to say. Sure you do. You are not... What do you think of what she said? Come on, judge it. What do you think of what she said? Well, it was wrong. Oh, I, I don't she's agree wrong. With you. I would say I don't agree with you. Uh, well, why don't you say something if you don't agree with it? I don't agree with you. What I else? Don't. Uh, what does that mean if you don't agree with her? That there were things that I remember that, that I did me. really good. So what are you saying about what she did to you? Um, <laughs> you're asking me a question that's very hard for me to answer. Go, go ahead. That's good. <laughs> uh, what did she do to me? It was like another one of her favorite things. Um, well, it was like whatever, it was, well, what it did was kill me. What? It, internally, it killed me. Like, I just felt dead. Sure it killed you. That's not answering the damn question. Okay. Uh, hey, you, you go were your, not good Hey, that you're year. stocking, right, Christmas, and you find a <laughs> hunk of coal? Yeah. Go ahead. What the heck is this for? Yeah. Is that what you're going to ask? Well, no, she'd she say... She answered it? Yeah. What do you mean I'm not... I wasn't good this year? 
You tell me, what is it? What do you mean by it being good this year? What did I do that was not good? What do you mean by good? What did I do? I need to find out in order to either figure Say, out what you're the what measure of. What do you think of. she's doing to oh, what you? Is, what do you think she's doing to you? Well, she's telling me first off that I'm not good. What is she doing to you at this event? What is she doing? She's doing God. Uh, uh, I feel like that's the block on my head. Uh, hey, I'm not capable. I can't go deeper. Well, can't answer. I can't ask her anything. I can't ask her what she's doing. And why I can't. can't you? Come on, you got the lump of coal. There it is. There it is. Well, that would indicate that. Um, what are you going to say to her? Come on, here's it. She just said that. Now it's your move. Well, um, I, you're wrong. I was, I was good this year. What, what are you talking about when you're saying I'm not hey, good? You're dealing with what she is saying. Right. You're, what is she doing to you, doing this and going in? Come on. She's doing something with you, to you, by doing what she did. Are you going to deal with that? Well, I'd say, well, are you, are you saying that I'm... What? Are you saying that I'm bad? Is that, that's the point. I'm okay. not good this year, therefore I'm a bad person. So, I, I don't know. I know I feel... I should answer it, but I don't know. I, I, you were not good this year. That's right. I was not good this year, according to you. Um, Look, you know what effect it had on you. Yeah, I was shocked. I right. believed her. I agreed with her that, hey, I'm... What is she doing, therefore, to you, at you, with you, at this moment? Well, by me not saying Now, any... keep that in your mind and answer. Uh, by me not saying anything... Hmm? By me not saying anything. No, no, come on, answer it. I don't know, Pierre. I'm not doing well. You can't answer it. Um, Someone is doing that to you, right? And I go along with it because of the fact that if they take the time, if, if I mean, parents that you love, put that in your stocking, they must be telling you something about yourself. Yeah, see? Yeah. You believe her. Therefore, yeah. there must be something about yourself that is basically what? Incapable. Yeah. You believe her. Can't go any deeper. I mean, you have to believe anybody who do that. I totally agree with you. <laughs> well, being older, I wouldn't. What? Know, but <laughs> what? I said I wouldn't believe her now, but... What do you mean you don't believe her now? Then how would you answer it? Uh, <laughs> I would... Well, I, I'd ask her what, I'd ask her what, 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 what? I'd ask her what she's referring to. What do you mean I'm not good? Oh, what, where, could, still, you, yeah, okay. could you tell me what I did that was so bad? What's she doing? I don't know, Pierre. Yes, she do. Okay. I you know the effect it had? Yeah, I'm not capable, can't go any deeper. But she's teaching you a lesson, isn't she? That's the lesson. What do you think of the fact that she's using this to teach you a lesson? <laughs> That's an interesting way to teach some kid a lesson. I don't see the connection. Um, how come I getting a piece of coal will shut If you down. believe that, there's something wrong with you. You yep. can't go deeper, right? right? You're not capable. I'm not capable of asking her, right. talking to her, relating right. to her. Yeah, yeah. She's shutting up. I'm 
you got that right. Hey, she shut down. On a certain level, yeah. Yeah, closed it down. Very thoughtful, isn't it? It's something very well, honorable. What it did was... Well, it's it, very honorable, is it not? It's a good thing. Boy, I'm glad <laughs> she was around. I don't know. What? Um, no? No. Then why don't you say something about it? Well, it shut down my seeing. What? Shut down my seeing because I couldn't ask and couldn't talk to What her. do you mean you couldn't? You didn't, you couldn't I do didn't. It now. Come on. Answer it. I didn't. I didn't tell her what I saw, which is, hey, Mom, you're giving me a piece of coal. Is that your gift to me? Um, well, I'll tell you what. I will return the gift to you. You can have it hmm. back. That's answering, see? What's that do? <laughs> I would never do that. Uh, wait a minute, you I just, just said seen, it. I don't even think that's wait real. Wait a minute, you said it. What does it do to say it? That it's false. What? I feel false about doing that. Yeah, by telling the truth. <laughs> oh, this isn't a gift, Mom. This is punishment. Here, you keep it. Oh, it's a punishment. <laughs> yeah. Without a crime. Yeah, I don't know what the crime was. Oh. It's very Christian, I can Oh, tell. very Christian. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. what do you think this of it? The Grand Inquisitor. What are you going to answer now? <laughs> Uh, well, you must be a reincarnated Grand Inquisitor, uh, because uh, you're just, you want to put me to death for some reason, and you can't give me the reason, hey, you're making what, it up. What does that do right now? That's clearer, but still phony. What? I still think it's phony. Well, it's not good enough, I agree <laughs> with you, but it's a little better, what the hell, yeah. what, what you can get. Weird. Ooh, that's terrible. Yeah, that's right. I'm punished for a crime. I don't even know. I, and I can't even ask what the crime is. I can't even go deeper to find out uh, what the crime is. You did call is. her something, though, didn't you? Grand Inquisitor. Yeah. Oh. Which is somebody who creates, a, creates a, a crime for you and then says it's okay to be, you're, you have to, so she's acting Agreed. like the Grand Inquisitor. Yeah, you have to agree that that's right to be punished. I'm, yeah, I'm a sinner, <laughs> not knowing the crime I did. Right? Yeah. Shoot. That's well, a piece of What coal. role is she playing then? <laughs> the Grand Inquisitor. Grand Inquisitor. High priest. Priestess. Yep. Wow. Yeah, she is. That's incredible. Right. Just buy a piece of coal. Yeah, what what, you, now what are you going to tell her and do with the coal? Give it back to her. Tell her maybe she <laughs> can use for? it for her furnace. What's up to her? What is this <laughs> uh, It's better. Hmm? It's better. I, now I understand what's going on. Yeah, the grand, that fits. Right. <laughs> That's one of her roles anyway. Yeah. That's putting a name on her. Yeah. That's unusual. I don't often do that. Right. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, Pierre. Oh, man. <laughs> Time for coffee. Yeah. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> Whew. <laughs> well, one thing is true. You can't get much out of a dream. <laughs>